What's up, mobile gamers? I've got a death wish. We're gonna use Sindri today. I, I just need to see, you know. Uh, all the healers, I think, are very bad to take into um, solo Royale Arena, except maybe um, Labula could be decent, and maybe Iris because of her damage. But when you're really looking at, like, who's the worst to take in, I think you have to put Sentry in the conversation. She's already the worst healer in the game. She's very, very bad compared to the other heroes, and she, I don't think you're going to be able to heal your shield when you use her ability. We'll have to double check while we're in a match here, Three, but when two, you're looking at it, one, we're slice. gonna have a hard time no matter how you slice it, especially, you know, with, we do have the coin. Okay, that'll be nice. The coins will be nice um, to get so we can try to get some armor and some damage up. But we're really going to have a tough time. Um, so I wouldn't mind a bot or two. And hopefully we can get the perk that lets you um, do extra damage to people who have more health than you. So we'll kind of see. I am going to, real quick, just move my reload over a bit. There we go. Just so it's on its own. There we go. This is the perk I was looking for. So you can click and show your perks. And Giant Slayer is the one we want because we are going to always have less health than people. And, you know, going up against like a, a Jabali or something like that is going to be difficult. So four for everything. And I think a light speed Assault might be decent. We'll have to see. So we'll probably try to also run something... We're going to keep the coins, that way we can try to get some stuff in the shop. Now, what I recommend, honestly, if you're going to play a healer, is somebody else. But if you want to play Sentry, pray for bots. And try to play the mode where you have people this with you. So, we're going to purposefully not take the Pie Bot mod. Because I want to see if it's even worth trying to heal yourself. Because um, I would imagine that they would change at least that in this game. That you can do your shield. Ooh. Okay, well, we need the coins so that we can get armor. So we're going to go with light speed Assault and hopefully be able to dodge the majority of attacks that come our way. And the drone is going to be extremely helpful for this mode. It's going to basically be my main way of dealing any damage. Which, on one hand, kind of sucks, but on the other hand, you know, if we can get the damage up, if it actually applies to the drone, Dragon you might be hostiles. able to see the old school Sindri that used to be really good at doing damage. Um, not really sure how the damage is looking. Another light speed assault. And I thought I heard a Hualing nearby. We'll see. Gonna go to the shop, we got six coins. And we're gonna go for the level four onslaught. Sorry, you trapped. Grab that. And we've Watch almost got enough for the level four onslaught or uh, armor. So we'll just kind of basically run around and wait for it to come into the coin slot here since we have that coin mod. Let me know what you guys think. I'm not. I'm not very excited about this, because I feel like the first person we see is just going to do some huge burst damage, like a, a hunter or something, and just absolutely this destroy us, hurt. and I'm really not looking forward to that. But hopefully we can put down the drone. I am running her first ultimate, because it's pretty much my only way of doing damage now. Um, not necessarily my only way of doing damage, but a very big part of how I plan to um, actually do good in this match. We'll kind of see how it goes. No airdrops yet, but we do have this, which is huge. Probably the biggest way we're going to survive. Just a little bit of juice. And you can hear there's actually... Okay, firepower. Yep, they did put one in the, the auditorium or whatever you want to call it. Oops. oops. It's, it's funny. I get this every time. 
unless I am recording and then you know it seems like it takes me a second to oh yep because I missed <laughs> oh man that's funny so we're gonna jump up and you slow yourself when you use the movement oh, and we just missed okay So, not too worried about it. I mean, if I was playing a damage hero and expecting a win, and when the circle's moving, okay. Yeah, we gotta get out of here, unfortunately. Use our teleport so we can just get out of the storm. I don't even want to be in the storm at all. I want them to have no chance to have an advantage. So, we'll go to the circle this way. And this is where I think we're going to find a lot of the higher enemies where they all have good weapons and stuff. Yep, I can hear them. It sounds like that's actually a chemist. Purple armor. And the drone is going to be my best friend in this mode. And gold armor, so we can actually switch it out if we need to. Yep, okay. There we go. And we'll kind of see. They might actually be boxed because they haven't shot the drone yet. And I want to... There we go. It's a chemist. Use the ult. Not even going to risk it. Especially when she had a pretty good shield. And it looks like most of them had similar... And this is where you get into the territory of having a hard time with these heroes. There we go. And so without the drone, we're dead for sure. But we do have a red shield now. And the overshield when you call the drone back. So I do think bot Jabali. All the Jabalis I have seen have been bots. Yep, it looks like he's a bot. So, this literally, it's just going to take time for me to get him. There we go. Kind of just annoying at this point. And we'll see if we get a damage up. Ooh, okay. We'll go with the teleportation so we can get another stock. And... Um... We're going to go up to the top. Take a little storm damage, it's worth it. We do have overshield. And we actually have a gold shield. So I'm gonna do something not a lot of people do. I'm gonna use that shield and we'll basically Oh. Victory! Alright. Well that that counts, I guess. <laughs> Alright, we'll just jump into another one. I will transition for you guys. All right, you guys, we changed up the skin, so we'll see if that's good luck or not. And um, can't believe we won the last one. He must have been a player who decided to be nice and give us the win because... Oh, here we go. Another mark. Lots of marks lately. There we go. And he's definitely not a bot because he missed a lot of shots. But he gave us a blue armor. To swap out for our broken ones, so no worries. Don't mind at all. This is usually a very um, uh, populated area. There's usually at least three people here. If you guys didn't know, there are four people to an area when you first spawn in. And we have been lucky enough to not really have to worry about anybody. We are going to try to see... Ooh, level 5 armor and targeted teleportation. Okay. That's Kazuma. No idea where he's at. Oh, there he is. Perfect. And that's how you use the drone. The drone is huge. 
I would say the drone is the only reason I have any chance of winning fights. We do have a lifesteal. We're going to keep that. And the blue pie bot, which will heal our shield for us. And, okay, coin. We'll go with coin and lifesteal. So we can get some mods. There is this Hunter. Is Looks like he's already low health. And you really have to be tricky with how you move. And free health. And there is what the pie bot can also come in handy for, which is the... Not only the detection of enemies and a bot Jabali, it seems. Oh, maybe not. Yeah, he is. And this is honestly just, you know. Ooh, okay. Mark's down. We're gonna kind of retreat a little bit just so the Mark doesn't have as much of a chance to take us out. He had the same perks as us. That's kind of funny. Okay, level 5 armor. And then we'll get the targeted teleportation in just a bit. So we'll see. Oh. And sorry for not talking when that happens. When I find somebody, it just basically freaks me out. And Red Shield is not something just you want to even tango with in this match. I would say literally the only reason we're probably doing okay is because we also have a red shield. There we go. Or or purple, I guess she had purple. Anyways. Um Yeah, nothing better than what we have, but targeted teleportation is basically a must when you have such low health. So we'll kind of go to the circle. Let's see, check the map. Decent. Okay, we're doing pretty good this game. But not as many people have died. This probably is going to be a longer match. Um, and no airdrops yet either. So, yeah, only one that's in the... Oh, it looks like the chemist is back. Turned off my healing, but that's fine because the bot is going to get her. And you'd be surprised. You basically don't want to attack a Sindri if she has a bot because the bot is crazy good. And you want to use the bot to your advantage where you can destroy it from afar and then attack. And I think that's where a lot of these people are failing to actually do good against me. This will be tough. So you can see she already destroyed our bot. Three seconds till it's back. Drop the bot. And now we basically, she's gonna have to decide if she wanted to destroy the bot us. Oh, we're dead? This oh, we died. Hurt. Okay, we were very close to getting her. And we're just gonna go straight back for my loot because I don't have a chance without good loot. Okay. Yep. So the only good thing about this is I killed a lot of people over here. So we basically will get a little bit of somewhat decent loot. And we should have enough time to go at that Gloria again. And there we go. Oh, and she, Defeat. she spawn camped me. Unfortunate. Well, that's what you expect. Um, Gloria is just insane, and without the surprise uh, advantage, you can't really expect to do much as Sentry. She basically had to wait for me, um, and if we would have been able to just run, I think we would have had a better shot. Just teleport away, that's what I probably should have done. So, I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. I really did not super enjoy that. I think... If you're going to pick another hero, you really should, you know what I mean? If you're going to pick any of these other heroes, you you should pick a Vanguard. That'd be decent if they have a movement ability like, you know, Fort has his shield, Fade has his rush. So that's pretty good. All the damage heroes, yes, all the damage heroes are perfect, perfect picks. Um, 
All the flankers are a good pick except for Vincent because I don't think that will work. We'll try, I guess we'll do a video later on him. And then I guess Neon and Chemist don't really have a place unless you are going to be playing duos. And then I think everyone is better in duos except for Sindri. The drone is kind of nice in duos. So maybe I'll drop a video about duos later in the month or something like that see how it goes let me know what you guys think and what you guys want for content because I'm trying to get up in the views a little bit and i don't know what you guys want to see and what you don't so let me know we've got tons of second alt content and tons more royale arena if that's what you guys enjoy so let me know down in the comments and we'll see you in the next one